Hey bros and buddies, what is up? My name is Jerry from Jerry Gaming, and today we're going to be building Winston from Overwatch. This is a plushy version of Winston. We're going to do this in three parts. We're going to break down to make it easier for you guys. We're going to start out by doing the legs, then the torso, arms, and head. That way it's broken down and it's easier to follow, and that's how I figured it'd be pretty easy to do. What we're going to go ahead and do is we're going to go ahead and need uh, light blue stained clay, black wool, Court stairs, smooth stone stairs, or uh, smooth stone, sorry, not stairs, uh, birch wood planks, and gray wool. Okay, so what we're gonna go ahead and do is start with Winston's legs. We're gonna need the light blue stained clay first. We're gonna go ahead and place a two by two by one block thick, uh, you know, like little platform, skip two, and then do the same thing, like so. We're then gonna go ahead and place black wool underneath in the back on the first level, two blocks of it. Place our court stairs side to side, keeping the flat edge on the outside, as you guys can see here. Then we're gonna go ahead and place two blocks thick of sandstone. Well, it's not really sandstone, it is smooth sandstone. There we go. Then what we're going to go ahead and do is right behind the black, right here where the sandstone begins, we're going to go ahead and place two blocks high of the gray wool. We're then going to go ahead and place two blocks of the smooth sandstone out more out from the other sandstone and then place birch wood planks on top. Then what we're going to go ahead and do is place two black, then two gray, and then four gray for the back end of Winston. Okay, so that's Winston's legs right here. So if you guys do not have this, please pause the video here while I go ahead and select the next box that we're gonna go ahead and need for his upper torso. Okay guys, we are ready for the torso. What we're gonna go ahead and need is gray wool, block of quartz, quartz stairs, stone slabs. We're also going to need stone brick stairs, cyan wool, black wool, smooth sandstone, and quartz slabs. Now this is also blocks for the arms, but we're gonna take a break in between the torso and the arms. So let's go ahead and start on the torso. We're gonna go ahead and need gray wool. I want you guys to go ahead and place three blocks of gray wool towards the back end of Wilts, uh, Winston, sorry. Then two blocks on top. I want you guys to go ahead and grab a block of quartz and then place a stair like so. We're gonna repeat the same process on this side so you guys can start with the quartz like so, the slab and, or the stair and the block. Then go ahead and place three blocks of gray wool. Then what I want you guys to do is place a block of quartz here and raise it up by three, a uh, total of three blocks on this part, two blocks on this part. So one, and then that's the second, third layer. There we go. Upside down stair here and a block there. Upside down stair there and a block here. Go ahead and bring that all the way across here and on this end as well. Then you're gonna take your gray wool and just fill in his back. And on the front of him, we're gonna go ahead and place blocks of quartz on the each side, three blocks, so it should look like this. And then the opening, you're just gonna place gray wool. So that's the low detail resolution of Winston. We are gonna go ahead towards the end of the video and add the detail, because we need his head before we can actually use the measurements to uh, finish his torso, because some of it's connected to his head. So next, if you guys do not have this here, please pause the video here and resume when you guys are ready. Okay, what we're going to go ahead and do now is take block A of quartz, place it right on that stair here, place a piece of black wool right there, and a piece of cyan wool right here. We're then going to go ahead and place quartz stairs there. Go ahead and place uh, smooth sandstone, two of them right here, and black wool on the, actually, sorry, it's gray wool, on the edges. Then what we're gonna go ahead and do is place four blocks of quartz and four blocks of gray wool. We're gonna go ahead and repeat the same thing over here. So again, block of quartz, cyan wool, black wool, quartz stairs. On the inside, you go ahead and place smooth sandstone, two blocks. On the outside, you go ahead and place uh, two blocks of gray wool. Again, then four blocks of quartz and then four blocks of cyan wool, or gray wool, sorry and then you should have this. So that was fairly easy, and if you guys do not have that, make sure you guys go ahead and pause the video here while I collect the blocks for uh, Winston's head. 
Okay guys, we're ready for Winston's head. What we're gonna go ahead and need is blue stained clay, block of quartz, gray wool, stone slabs, clay, yellow wool, snow, um, light blue stained clay, and spruce wood planks. We're also gonna need a bunch of other blocks just for detailing, but we'll get into that when it's more relevant. What we're gonna go ahead and do is take a block of quartz, place it in this corner here, and in this corner here, and then go ahead and place blue stained clay in between. We're then going to go ahead and take gray wool, placing two blocks on each edge, and then three blocks of quartz blocks. So one, two, three, coming out like so. We're then going to go ahead and take stone slabs, place two blocks of these stone slabs up, oops, like so. And as you guys can see, see how it's like one slab and then two slabs stacked on top of each other? That's what it should look like. Then we're going to go ahead and get blocks of quartz and go three blocks after that. Then we're going to go ahead and take blue stained clay and just fill in the back. We're going to go ahead and take the blue stained clay. So technically, it's Winston's head starts right here. So we've only gone up by two blocks. So we need to go up by six. So this is the third block high. Now this is fourth block high. Five. And six. So that's Winston's head all the way built up. We're then going to go ahead and go one, two, three, and then four. One, two, three, and then four. And then we're gonna go ahead and take this all the way up to the very top of Winston's head as well. Then what we can go ahead and do is just take Winston's head and start to fill in the top part. Now the front of Winston's face is not connected yet and we'll get to that in a minute. We're then gonna go ahead and take gray wool and we're gonna go ahead and place the gray wool right here. On this side here and on this side over here. So this is Winston's face right here. What we're gonna go ahead and do is place block of snow, block of clay, block of blue, light blue stained clay, and then gray wool. Again, snow, clay, light blue stained clay, gray wool. We're then gonna bring the gray wool in by two blocks and fill it in with light blue stained clay here, or regular blue stained clay, sorry. So if you guys do not have this, make sure you guys go ahead and do this before we get into the detailing of Winston's face because it starts to get a little bit complex. Okay, what we're gonna go ahead and do is take the light blue stained clay, place one on each side here, yellow here and here, spruce wood planks right underneath the yellow, go ahead and place gray wool right underneath the blue in between the light blue get light blue stained clay and then go ahead and fill this in right here like so take glass place it on top like this go ahead and take a black carpet and place it on top of that place nether brick slabs and then carpet on top of the nether brick slab so it should look like this Okay, so what we're then going to go ahead and do is take stone slabs, place them on the upper part here, and then above that. So it's a half slab down here, and up here. What we're going to go ahead and do is build Winston's jawline by placing four blocks in the middle of the quartz slab, and then placing two stone buttons for his nostrils. What we're gonna, then going to go ahead and do is right underneath of his head, we're going to go place blue wool, like so or blue stained clay, and then I just ran out of the blocks that we're gonna go ahead and need for the rest of this. So what I'm gonna go ahead and do is, actually, there's one more thing I gotta do before I get rid of all this. So on the back side of his head right here, and here, we're gonna go ahead and place the buttons, stone buttons. Okay, so like I said, I'm out of the blocks that I need for his jawline, and the front part of his decorative chest, and his back piece. So I'm gonna go ahead and get those blocks that I'm gonna need for this, and I'll be right back when I'm all done. Okay guys, we are back, and what we're going to go ahead and need for the bottom part of Winston's jaw is yellow wool, block of quartz, quartz stairs, stone slab, stone brick stairs, gray wool, quartz slabs. Um, also, we're going to go ahead and need uh, buttons, and I want to go ahead and put the buttons on these right here, on this side, and on this side here, before I forget, because it's, it's such a small detail I will forget. Okay, we do not need the stone buttons no more, but again, we need the blocks that are in the inventory. I want to go ahead and use the yellow wool 
place it right below the blue wool, see how it, or blue stained clay, and then it's the yellow wool. Then we're gonna place two blocks of quartz. Then we're gonna go ahead and place a frontward facing and then an upside down facing stair, so as you guys can see. Again, frontward facing, and then upside down. What I would like you guys to go ahead and do is place a block of, uh, what's this? Stone slab here, stone, oh. Stone slab here. Let's see if I can do this on the first try. And two stone brick stairs like this. So see how they're back to each other? And then I want you guys to go ahead and get gray wool place gray wool over this and then in the beginning or right in between his legs. Then we're going to go ahead and take quartz slabs and place them covering the light blue color right next to the blue wool or the blue stained clay, sorry. Then I want you guys to go ahead and get stone slabs and place one here and one here and that forms his jaw. So you guys can see, you guys can see the mouthpiece of him coming together. What I want you guys to go ahead and do, what I want you guys to go ahead and do is grab buttons again, I almost forgot, and place them on his upper arms right here. Again, like I said, I always forget the smallest little detail. And if you guys do not have this, please pause the video here, and then we're gonna go ahead and fix his hair for the last part and do his backpack. Okay guys, we're almost done finishing the plushie, so all we need is the last few blocks that I have in my inventory, which is yellow wool, stone slabs, gray wool, quartz stairs, quartz, or a block of quartz, I should say, uh, yellow stained glass, orange stained glass, stone brick stairs, and blue stained clay. So let's go around to his backside, and we're gonna start to build the back thing, the backpack, or the thing that he has on his back. We're gonna go ahead and see next to this button right here, we're gonna place a block of quartz, on both sides, place a quartz stair beyond that, place a quartz slab below the quartz block, and then below the quartz stair, place a block of gray wool, and then right where it lines up with the gray wool, we're gonna go ahead and place two slabs of um, stone. So two stone slabs. And it should look like this from the side. On both sides, it looks identical. We're then going to go ahead and get the yellow wool, place two blocks of the yellow wool, place one block of the yellow wool on this side, and one here. So it should look like that, and then this from the side. Then what we're going to go ahead and do is take slabs, place one here and here, go ahead and place that all the way across, and then like this. So it's kind of like a shape, or kind of like a little bit of a U shape. Place. Oops, I gotta bring it up by one. Sorry about that. That's my bad. So bring it up by one slab. See how there's a gap? And then place orange stained glass. Then yellow stained glass. Then stone slabs. And then indented stone, oops. Indented stone slabs, if I don't break the back of Winston's head. Here and here. So it should look just like this. The last thing that we're going to go ahead and do is go ahead and work on Winston's hair. So what we're going to go ahead and how we're going to do this is go start right here, go one, two, three, over by one, one, two, and then just go one, two. Then we're going to go one, two, and then one, two. And there you guys go. So it kind of looks like a weird looking McDonald's symbol, kind of. So that's how you guys build Winston, and there you guys go. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial as much as I enjoyed making it. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. It would really help me out a lot. Hit that follow button, share it on Twitter and Reddit. It would mean the world to me, guys. And as always, thanks for watching.